We're here at SEMA 2025 in the Baxter Performance booth, here with Kevin, checking out their brand new product for the show. So this thing is awesome, Kevin. Tell us all about it, because it's kind of cool and I love the color. Well, right, so for several years now, we've been selling products that utilize uh, a Schrader valve to evacuate oil out of the filter. Because we were inverted, we had to find a clean way to, to empty the oil filter. So what we do now is we have uh, a thin plate that mounts right between say the engine block or a remote filter location like this. And it's a very thin 3 16 of an inch uh, thick adapter, goes on the original filter stud and the uh, oil filter just screws right onto it. And even with it on really tight, this, when you take it off, will not change its position, stays locked on. And it does that because we use a really, really good um, Biton seal. On the back side, you'll see a nice low profile seal. It just allows it not to rotate when you take off the oil filter or anything like that. So it stays put. With this particular size here, three inch is probably gonna be the, our most popular size. This will even fit on a Harley Davidson and uh, that's a horizontal mount filter. So it's good for motorcycles, boats, and where it's hard to access on a boat, you might wanna use a remote charging uh, hose that will, uh, um, supply the compressed air to the uh, um, evacuator itself, make it easier to uh, get to the filter after that, trying to charge it and then take it off. So it's a very clean process. And that's really cool because especially on some of these late model vehicles, the oil filters are getting um, in more tight and tight places. And yeah. it's almost like they're hiding them. And then they're above a bunch of stuff. You go to screw it yeah. off and then you end up covered in oil. This is gonna keep a lot of that oil off you, which is neat. Absolutely true. And you know, if you have a 5.7 liter Hemi and it's mounted in a Ram 1500 truck, you know what we're talking about because it's a bear to get up there and trying to get that oil filter out. It's very difficult, makes a big mess when you're done with it. So not only do you guys have these for spin-on filters, but you have them for cartridge filters too, correct? We do as a service tool. So like on a uh, Toyota cartridge oil filter, usually you have to use a plastic service tool. You have to shove it up in there. You have to wait for it to drain. With our tool, very nice, very quick. Just spin it in the bottom of the uh, service port and then hit it with compressed air. Cause and effect does the same thing. Empties the oil filter, moves through the positive aspect of the engine through the oil galleys, and then uh, empties the oil filter, more efficient oil change, and then remove it. It's a service tool. So you'll keep this in your toolbox when you service your vehicle, or you, we not only have it for the uh, Toyotas, but we also have it for Volkswagen and Audi also, and then services the filter in the same way. So something else to keep in your toolbox. Now, what's the availability on these, Kevin? Well, we're working with you folks, in fact, and we're going to be launching this. Uh, we're shooting for January of this next year, and they're in production right now. Three different sizes initially, different size nuts to go on these, so there'll be several different SKUs. But one size does not fit all. In the particular case, we're going to call out exactly what the dimensions are. And in the case of a, a 6.2 liter Chevy engine, this is not going to work because it's recessed in a well. What we have here is a thicker and deeper adapter so that it'll clear the, the well and then we can get to the actual freighter valve. So to check these out, head over to summitracing.com and see our full selection of Baxter Performance products. We can't wait to install a couple. All right, thanks a lot for being yep. here, appreciate it. So until next time, guys, I'm Justin with Summit Racing. We have Kevin Baxter here and we'll see you guys later.